this is the raspberry pi whose os got corrupted possibly due to a power outage so i'm starting all over again i have put some thermal pads and a heat sink on the chips i salvaged this heat sink from a broken tv to keep everything in place i have used some threads so this is raspberry pi 3b plus and this has a full hdmi port audio jack and a micro usb port for power this also comes with an ethernet port and four usb 2 ports pretty basic just to get everything done and it comes with standard 40 gb io pins i have a 16 gig card i'll use this card to install the os you may use a 8 gig card as well but for me 16 gig seems about right we would also need a micro sd card reader like this I have used Polina HR for burning the image to the disk. You may use Rufus as well. Both of them work pretty well across all the platforms. I have attached the Raspberry Pi to the monitor, keyboard and a mouse. There is not much to do here. Just fill up the normal details and reboot the system. Upon rebooting, you will boot into the operating system. And the only thing we need to do is enable VNC. VNC would help us get into Raspberry Pi remotely. We will grab the IP address of Raspberry Pi from our router and use it for a VNC connection with our ID and password. I have already made a guide on my website. It helps me copy paste the commands and replicate the system quickly. You can grab all the commands from there. All you need to do is copy and paste. Once the installation is done, we will copy the login password for Pihole. It's a good idea to keep it safe as we won't be able to access our Pihole configuration without it. As we can see, the Pihole is not receiving any DNS requests. We need to go to our router and change the DNS server to our Pihole IP address. That is it. There is nothing more to do. The Pihole is up and running. It is, it is receiving the queries and blocking the bad ones out. I am opening a few websites that I know have many ads. As you can see, all the requests are going through the Pihole, which is exactly what he wanted. So that is it for this video. I'll come up with a new project soon.